Sarah, where are you going? I'm leaving. What do you mean you're leaving? I can't live like this anymore. I told you, I'm working everything out. Things are getting better, I promise. Better? Have you seen these, Justin? These are all from bill collectors threatening to take the apartment away if you don't pay them. I have been giving them everything I can. But you have to understand it takes time for these things to work themselves out. Time. You sit here doing nothing while I'm working trying to keep us going. I sacrifice everything for you and your dreams. Do you appreciate anything I do around here? Of course I appreciate it. Every day I thank you for everything. Why are you doing anything to change it? you. You, you used to be better than this. You used to be stronger than this. What happened to all the goals you had set up for yourself? What happened to the Justin I fell in love with two years ago? I'm still here, Sarah. I am. And I promise things are going to get better. Please, just give me time. Bye, Justin. I'll have my dad come pick up my stuff. Okay? Who are you? How'd you get in my bed? What do you mean? Don't you remember? You left me here. You told me that you hated me and that I needed to make you happy again. So I sacrificed myself for you. I went through diets, enhancement surgeries, and job training just so that I could be everything that you wanted me to be and make you happy again. I can't believe that you came back. What's wrong? I've been all alone for so long, begging for you to come back to me. And now you're standing right in front of me, and you won't even hold me? I feel, I feel trapped in here. I can't take this anymore. Please, tell me what I have to do. Tell me what I have to do to make you appreciate me. Come back. Please come back.
cannot lift these damn weights anymore. He almost had it. He could have lifted them. I don't know why I bother. I'm not strong enough for this. You shouldn't give up so quickly. Things like this take time. Time? Last year, I used to be able to lift them. Now, I can't get them off the rack. I should be improving by now. This is your fault. You stood there and watched me fail. Every time I try to be strong, you give up on me. You're the reason I'm a failure! With your advice, I have invested a lot of time and money in myself. I've started my own business, budgeted my finances according to your guidelines, with the assurance that this would be a small sacrifice to pay for a great future profit. And sir, you were right. I have generated a small but promising amount of clientele. I'm beginning to earn back some of my initial investment. You even assured me a 50% net profit in the first year. And most of all, you promise never to give up on me. But somewhere along the way, you stopped believing in me. You told me I wasn't good enough, that I was a lost cause. Since then, I've been trying to keep myself from going under. I've lost clients and I haven't been able to gain new ones. I've put so much time and money into my project that I can't afford my personal finances. Bill collectors are calling me daily asking for their money. I just don't have anything to give them. So much has gone wrong that I don't know where to start in order to fix it. I don't know how much longer I can hold on. <laughs> Succeed. I have potential. Don't give up on me. I'm a strong person. Don't give up on me. I'm worth it. I can be appreciated. Don't give up on me. I'm a strong person. I can be appreciated. I have potential. Don't give up on me. I'm worth it. I want to succeed. I'm a strong person. Don't give up on me. 